High betting experts on Thursday the 6th of April are off to Yorkshire to Weatherby on Thursday. The ground drying out all the time. I think that's going to be a theme of things over the next few weeks looking at the weather forecast. It's actually good to soft at the time of recording, but I've priced it all up as though it's going to be good ground with the weather forecast. We start off with our betting expert daily nap in the two o'clock. This is a two mile five furlong handicap hurdle, uh, a class four for four year olds and upwards. Really good prize money. Weatherby have made a real effort today. Eight and a half thousand pounds the winner and I think Ollie Murphy's butch is very much the one to side with on his handicap debut. Now Ollie Murphy has been in blistering form at the minute. Everything he runs is winning or running well. I think he's had around 16 winners in the last fortnight uh, and around about a 30% strike rate and even the ones that are getting beat we backed the wolf earlier in the week he ran an absolute screamer they're all running well and this novice is a six year old he's run three times over hurdles he's a work in progress he won last time out at Utoxta last month from Miles from Wicklow who's since run well in defeat to Ascot uh, he starts off into handicaps from a fair mark he's still raw get doing things wrong but he managed to win last time out and I think there's loads more improvement in the tank I suspect also this one furlong longer trip on better ground at a flat track will suit him. He's got a bit of scope and potential to do a good deal better than this and I think he'll take an awful lot of stopping here under the red hot Adrian Heskin. Our betting expert value angle selection runs in the 3.45. This is a two mile handicap chase, a class four for five year olds and upwards. There's 9,600 quid to the winner of this one. Uh, it's really excellent effort and I think this is a golden opportunity for Sal of Rebecca Menzies to bounce back to winning form. Now the negatives, he's a hard puller, he's a a very tricky ride and he hasn't won since January 2021 the positives well the yards had a really good season he's very well handicapped now on the pick of his form he was weak in the market and needed the run at Kelso after five months off last time out if you watch that run back for most of it if you didn't know Sal you'd think he was about to absolutely bolt up he had most of them stone cold four out looking like he was going to win on the bridle but he got very tired which is pretty typical of him but Kelso on heavy ground sat him. He's been running for most of the winter from a falling mark at tracks like Hexham and I just think that these days watching him back, he's the sort of horse, he just needs to breeze along on spring ground and I really hope uh, with that run under his belt, Nathan Moscrop will be positive from the front round Weatherby, which incidentally was the track he last won at uh, over two years ago. I think if he can put his jumping and strong travelling to good use from the front here, he could have these class four rivals in real trouble a long way out and hopefully with his fitness sharpening for that recent run, he'll be able to see things out better than usual. Best of luck on Thursday, betting experts, and please remember to like and comment on all of our YouTube videos.